Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel. Today I finally have a video that you guys have been requesting for some time now and it is my closet tour. Now the reason it's taken me such a long time is because I never really have it 100% organized or 100% finished and I still don't but I just really don't want to keep dragging it along so today I'm just going to show you what I have it's pretty basic nothing super luxurious I just reused all my furniture that I had when I lived in my apartment like four or five years ago yeah behind this door is my closet I'm really excited I hope um you guys enjoy it. You guys have wanted to see it for a while now. So, um, before we get started, if you are not subscribed, please be sure to hit that subscribe button and that bell notification so you get notified when I upload videos. So, let's get into it. So, here is my closet. As you can see, I have one wardrobe here. I have my vanity in the center, another wardrobe here. And this little section is where my shoes are. Okay, dolls, so when you first walk in, this is the door into the room. On the right-hand side, we have all of my heels. So top to bottom, you guys have seen this side in videos quite often, so I'm sure that's not a surprise to you. I like to color coordinate my heels, and these actually aren't all my heels. I have a few on the other side, but I also do still have some stored away. And then I have these cute little posters. I believe I got these at um, Home Goods, but I got them a long time ago. It's been a while. And then I have this little makeup tr tray that says hair, face, and nails. Obviously, I don't use it for that stuff. I'll normally put like some PR packages or random stuff that I need to put away in here, especially when I need to hurry up and clean up my closet. Now on this side over here, I have my longer dresses or my fancier dresses. So the longer ones are in the back and then, well, these are supposed to go in the back, but when I get new items, I just tend to stuff them here. Uh, everything used to be coordinated but of course I always have to do a closet cleanup maybe once every few months because then I just start throwing things wherever and then it gets disorganized so right now it's disorganized but these are all just dresses and a few rompers back here that are um, longer dressier not rompers jumpsuits sorry about that and then I have my lingerie here this is some of the pieces and then I have some other pieces in my actual room and then I have just this cute little lingerie sign here and some random bags up here purses so because it's such a small space I can't really get the camera in here but um, these are all the heels I have my nice comfy kind of uh, Cortez's here and Nike's and Adidas down at the bottom those are the ones or and Vans and some flats and now moving on over here it is my vanity and you guys can actually see the ring light through there so sorry but it's really hard filming this tour on my own where's Jay when I need him this is a vanity I got maybe about it was in 2014 so five years ago but this is my favorite purchase of like all time so starting with the top drawer these are just a lot of random things I have uh, not specific um, it was organized I had like highlighters in here and certain eyeshadows that I used all the time and uh, my foundation but then I kept getting more and more stuff so I slowly just started piling it in this so this is kind of like the random pile of stuff and then going into the next one I have all my palettes here these are a lot of the main ones I use or some that just fit nicely into the space that I needed so I placed it here okay so I just have to hold the camera because it's really difficult trying to angle this camera but so this little section here has to a shelf in here so it gives two separate compartments and the bottom unit I just have my blow dryer this is where I keep my blow dryer and then a few just random things I'm not even gonna reach back there getting to the top portion I need to get a different screw because um, the thread on the screw is messed up so it just falls off either way but this is where I keep all my hair stuff my curling irons my flat irons 
I have some extensions there. Um, my blow dryer extension here. So this is just really all my hair tools. I do have more, but these are the main ones that I use often. And then moving on to this next drawer, this is basically my eyelash drawer. It was organized, but of course when I'm in a rush, I just throw everything in. And this drawer right here is my hairbrush drawer. Yes, I do need to clean these brushes out, but whatever. So I have all the brushes that I use all in this little drawer. And then I have a nice little plug here. So it's nice that I can plug my curling iron or my blow dryer right here is a whole bunch of random stuff. These two are my, um, these two are my foundations that I use. It's just easy access to pull. I have some more hair tools right here, some Olaplex stuff, some face mask stuff, some hair stuff. So it's a little bit of everything. And then down here, um, you can't really see right now, but there's just a lot of foam rollers. There's foam rollers in that shoe box there. So and moving up to the top of the vanity to the left hand side, I have this lipstick holder that uh, Kat Von D Beauty sent to me. And then over here on this side, I have my little brush holder. This brush holder I actually got on Amazon. I'll link it down below. It is so adorable. It's just so nice because you just stick your brushes in there and voila, they stay. I actually need to get another one because I have way too many brushes in here, but these are the main brushes that I use. Yes, I do need to clean them. Gosh, cleaning brushes is such a pain in the ass, and I'm not going to do it every day. I don't care what anybody says. <laughs> Back here, I have actually these uh, perfume bottles. They are empty, uh, more like vintage style. These were from Nordstrom, but uh, they were given to me. Uh, they were just going to throw them out, and I wanted them, so they gave them to me. Yay! And this is my hairspray. I like to hide this behind the mirror so you just don't see all the chaos. And these are some of my perfumes. So behind this mirror, I have some other brushes that I'll use every so often. I don't use them all the time, but I still like to keep them back there. Just hidden, out of sight. And that is it for my vanity. So now moving on to this next area here. This is where I keep my tops, blouses, and then at the bottom section is where I have my shorts and the shorter skirts. Because there were three rows, I had to, the bottom row is kind of short, so it was perfect for the length of my shorts. They're not dragging on the floor, and some other skirts that I have, they're not dragging on the floor as well, and they're not taking up other space. So I don't like to coordinate by color. I like to coordinate by style because sometimes I don't think about what color do I want to wear today. It's like, what style do I want to wear today? Do I want to wear a long sleeve, short sleeve? Do I want do I want to dress up? Do I want to dress down? Now this is the side you guys never see. So I always have my uh, soft lights here. This is where I film and this is uh, where the ring light goes. So normally you guys face the other direction with all my heels. Well, this is the other side that you guys don't see. So I have all my little makeup collection here and my lights I tend to keep out because it's such a hassle to put them away and then bring them back out when I'm going to film, especially now that I'm filming more often. I just don't see the point in putting them away. Okay, so first we're going to go in with this unit. This little unit is one that I purchased on Amazon as well. I loved it. It fits a nice amount of things. Moving on to the next one is my lipstick holder. I did get this one on Amazon as well. A lot of these uh, things I got on Amazon. And then this other one, again, fits some eyebrow stuff, some lipsticks some eyeliner, some liquid lipsticks, and some mascara. So yes, I do have too much makeup. <laughs> and to the right of that is this other IKEA unit I got. This was the other unit that I had to have to fit some more dresses in. So this smaller portion I have some shorter dresses that can fit here and then on the ends I have longer dresses. I also have some belts down there that need to be organized. Uh, once again, I'm just all over the place. I'm not very organized at the moment. So moving on to the opposite side of the table, I have basically my little purse unit here. I don't know if you can see. And then it also does come with two drawers and then another little cabinet down at the bottom. Here is a close-up of all my purses. 
nice and kind of organized by size. Well, I tend to do it by size and then what fits. And then those are the two drawers. And this drawer, it's kind of just a lot of random hair stuff. And then these are all beanies and scarves. I just filled it up to the max. And then down here, down here was where I kept um, my softbox lights, just the uh, bulbs. And now moving on to this side, this is the side where I have my sweaters, my flannels, my jackets, and my coats. And then the lower portion has my swing skirts here. And then I also have my high-waisted flare dress pants here. And then I have a few dresses folded here that I was able to fold and it'd be fine. And then I have my rompers. Moving on to the unit right next to it. This also is pretty much a makeup and jewelry unit. I also bought this at Ikea five years ago, so I don't remember how much it cost, but I'm, I know they still have it. Um, this is just some random palettes that I had to fit here, some brushes. I have some eyeshadows in the back. This thing is just a mess. <laughs> Here I have all of my chokers. I have something in the back with chokers and then this right here with chokers. Sorry, I don't want my boobs to pop out. And this right here has chokers, a little bit of rings down at the bottom. And then the unit all the way at the bottom is another makeup case unit. Over here I have my glasses. I do have more glasses, but they're actually in my other room in my actual room on a sunglass stand. So, but these are the main ones that I like to use or that I feel like I'm gonna use often. And then at the top of this, I have my little candles, some uh, Betty Page, and then I have some bracelets, some rings. This is my little earring case where I keep all of my earrings and some other necklaces, some hats, some vintage hats here. And this is one of my favorite favorite units this has basically all my lip liners some of my eyebrow products but mainly lipsticks 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 so here is a close-up some foundation some eyeshadow palettes in the back lipsticks more lipsticks and those are, ooh, I organized them by color, some foundations, and then here I have a lot of my palette. And I forgot to mention, I actually got this little hook chandelier where you put candles on. I got it at Ross, and I believe it was $19.99. I just thought it was so cute. It adds just a cute little fancy detail. So that is it for my closet tour dolls. I hope it wasn't too boring and I hope I went into detail or that's what you wanted to see. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. That'll help me and my channel out. But thank you all for suggesting this video. Let me know what you would like to see next. And I love you dolls. Bye!